Central Texas students returned to class today at several of our largest school districts, and many of them did choose to learn online, but that has come with a few headaches. Six News reporter Andrew Moore tells us how things went. Andrew? You're always going to have a few issues with students going to back to school online. But when we spoke to school districts today, they said 96% of students were able to connect. Those that couldn't, they said, couldn't because of password issues or because they didn't know how to log in properly. Although people on Facebook said they had additional problems. Some parents said it wasn't quite clear how the schedule was supposed to work. Others were having trouble getting the codes they needed for classes couldn't log into classes or received unclear directions. Some kids sat in front of a laptop with nothing to do and ended up taking a nap. So what are school districts doing to help you resolve the issues? Well, Belton sent us this phone number and email for parents to contact them at. Temple ISD said they had a helpline available as well as step-by-step -step guides online on their parent help hub. And finally, Waco ISD spokesman Joshua Wucher told us they sent out login information for parents well in advance and also had additional options for parents throughout the day. Uh, they can first try their teacher and they have the opportunity to uh, sign in to the help desk request form and if it's uh, before four o'clock and then from four to eight have the opportunity to uh, call the help desk. Some parents were concerned that their student would be counted absent if they weren't able to log in. But both Temple ISD and Waco ISD assured me there would be other way to account for their students' attendance throughout the day. You can find more information on how to get a hold of these school districts if you need some support at kcentv.com after the newscast. Andrew Moore, 6 News. All right, thanks, Andrew. Waco ISD will also have its helpline available until 8 tonight. Tech support at other school districts may not be available until the morning.